Harold Kita kembali Dalam rancangan Kat mana kita? Huerto Mana ni? Bukan Bukan Huerto aku kat mana? Oh yeah, aku nak beli Beli barang Hmm? No Where am I? Bank Apartments Apollos Cahe Courtyard Seaset Outpost Meridian Place I forgot Hey Garus I forgot Bank? Where is this? Welcome to Kanala Exports I forgot to wait What the heck? What the heck? <laughs> Hana I don't 
there anymore. You gotta see. I don't have money, so nothing I can do. This metagel formula. Figured you could make good use of it. Where did you find this? Never mind, it doesn't matter. Yes, we can put this to good use. Thank you. No, it's fine. We won't be needing your support. <laughs> found a better variant of metagel that allows for an even higher absorption rate among aquatic species. You'd like a sample? Why, of course. We'll be happy to send you one. Just as we sent one to every pharmaceutical company in Citadel space. <laughs> Sin, baby. Commander Shepard. When I go when, when I heard Earth was under attack, I tried Sign to call. I never got through. Thane, good to see you staying in shape. My disease kills slowly. With enough care and a healthy lifestyle, it can be delayed for a few years. Oh yeah, he's dying. Of course, my allotted time has come and gone. Now I exercise because it pleases me. What are you doing here? Visiting a friend, Caden. He got hurt protecting me. The human biotic in intensive care. <coughs> I saw the marks of an implant. Yeah. Oh, you cannot fight anymore? We have spoken. Thin? He seems an honorable sort. Your enemies may try to finish him off here. I will look out for him. I appreciate it, Thane. I am near the end of my life. It is a good time to be generous. Can you fight, Thane? Kepral Syndrome has put most of my other plans on hold. I'm back on the Normandy on an important mission. Sure could use you. I would not be as I was before. I need daily medical attention. And if I know you, you will want to fight the Reapers somehow. Mm. You need the best at your side. And I am not at mine. You don't have to wrestle down Krogan and break their necks. I'm sure we could find you lighter work. I am at peace with what I've done in my life, Shepard. There comes a time when one must rest from war and conflict. It is not your time, but it is mine. Do you know how much time you have left? I've been to several doctors. My favorite gave me three months to live. Nine months ago. It's freeing to find no requirements placed on me. No responsibilities, <laughs> no fears. It is a good end to a life. Are you in a lot of pain? At times. The oxygen transfer proteins don't form correctly. Your human equivalent would be hemoglobin. As a result, my blood is low in oxygen. No matter how much I breathe in, I get tingling, numbness. And that is the best of it. As for my brain, I cannot track the damage. I just experience dizziness from time to time. Bye, Thane. Hey. I wish the best for you, Thane. And I for you. Do not grieve for me. I have mm. good doctors. My son visits regularly. Perhaps we will keep up via the extranet now that you are free. Until we meet again, Shepard. Bye, Thane. Can I talk again? <laughs> I wish the best for you. <laughs> and I for you. Do not grieve. Fuck you, Dan. Perhaps we will keep up. Welcome back to Huerta Memorial Hospital, Commander Shepard. How may I help you? Thank you. Please speak with me again. No. It's completely terrible. 
tasteless to call this place Puerta Memorial. President Puerta died of a stroke two years ago, ma'am. I think you meant to say the man was dead for an hour and a half and his political enemies piled on enough propaganda to get the hospital name changed. He can't remember his own name without the B.I. in his head telling him what it is. Trust me, in this building, we know dead. The Supreme Court says he's alive. Five justices say he's alive. Two of them appointed by him. The name is what it is. It's completely tasteless to call this place Huerta Memorial. President Huerta died of a stroke two years ago, ma'am. I think you meant to say the man was dead for an hour and a half and his political enemies piled on enough propaganda to get the hospital name changed. He can't remember his own name without the V.I. in his head telling him what it is. Trust me, in this building... Having a V.I. drive your body isn't life. Are Reaper husks alive? You did not just say that. But it's the same thing, isn't it? He walks and makes noises just like they do. Fine. I guess I'm just surrounded by zombies. Thanks. Took her long enough to get the hint. <laughs> what the heck was that? We were deployed to Tiptree. It's a small human colony. We were supposed to help with feedback. And the enemy was landing. Just scouts returning things a few Big Hello. Hello again, Commander. Here to see our patient? How is Caden doing? Stable. There's no evidence of cognitive impairment from the concussion, but multiple shoulder fractures are still on the mend. Bed rest under observation is all that's needed now. I'm sure a visit would be welcomed. With a center of this size, you must have a lot of direct reports. We've got 12 full-time doctors and over 50 support staff. It can be overwhelming, quite different from my days in the wards. How are your medical supplies holding up? We're well stocked now, but I we've posted guards on our reserves. War profiteering mm -hmm. is... Keep up the good work, Doctor. You too, Commander. Hello. Why are you scanning? Yes, I'm trying to place a call to Grissom Academy. They have biotic amp interfaces. I may be able to adapt for a sorry use. It says the station's communication system is offline. Of course. If these interfaces make our commandos better on the field, I'll hold for as long as you need. Listen to me, those prototypes are vital. We need these biotic upgrades to fight the Reapers. I know the Ismar frontier isn't safe. Yes, yes. All I can say is that unless we get those prototypes back, this project is a galaxy. Nothing. Okay, I need surgery, but when can I get back to the front? You're not. What? You have extensive nerve damage. Once we remove the leg, we can't install a prosthetic for at least five weeks. I told my squad I'd fly back next week. I'm sorry, but that's impossible. I'd like an answer, Major. The galaxy has need of exceptional soldiers like you, now more than ever. You'll have it soon, Counselor. I promise. I look forward to it. Shepard? Hey, did you? Udina? Hey. Shepard, hey. You, you just missed snack time. Actually, that's probably a good thing. Thanks for coming. No problem. What did Udina want? Still thinking about the Spectre position? Oh, it was a big honor. A huge responsibility. Just hmm? need to be sure. I got, no, I, don't know. I got you this. <laughs> wow, thanks. Oh, from where? That's from really where? great. <laughs> from your Just butt. Just a little pick me up. Maybe when I'm out, we can crack it open and celebrate. I am so ready to get out of here, Shepard. You can't tell that I'm tied to this bed by medical red tape. I'm a doc. Doc says I'm good to go, but then she always finds just one more test to run. You doing okay? My implant got a little rattled, so Doc just wants me to keep the biotics offline for a bit. It's really no big deal. Need me to break you out? <laughs> I'll let you know. I'm glad you asked me to come. 
It's good to see you're gonna be okay. Thanks. You almost died on my watch. It was horrible to see. I want you to be straight with me then. So I just want to make sure, after Mars, after Horizon, you and me, we're good. We've been through hell together, at each other's backs. That kind of bond is hard to break. No, not just that. You were my commander, sure, but you listened, too. We went through Asher's death together. Yeah. We did. So what do you say? <sighs> Are we good? We're good. It was great to yeah, have you back be... on the Normandy. Thanks. Feel like we've cleared the air? Yeah, you know, I'm... I'm not sure that I've been wrong about Cerberus, but... I've been wrong about you. I should let you get back to the Normandy. Wish I could come with you. Take care of yourself, Caden. We need you at 100%. Will do. Thanks for coming. That's all? Something else, Shepard? No, that's all? Where's your family? Okay. Are they safe? My family? My parents live in Vancouver. But Dad's family owns an orchard in the BC interior. They were headed out there on a shuttle the day of the attack. Heard from them? No. Not yet. But I hope... Huh. I'm hoping Dad's alliance training has kept them safe. Must be killing them not knowing where I am. You said your implant got rattled. Everything good? Uh, the medical gibberish was a bit more impressive, but that's what I took away. Rattled. Found a great doc at HQ that's fascinated by the L2 implant. Kind of her pet project. The headaches are as bad as ever, but she's, she's got me on a regimen of acupuncture and meds and some nasty tasting concoction. Won't tell me what it is. But my biotics are stronger than ever. Maybe some things get better with age. Or maybe you have. <laughs> are you flirting with me, Commander? Wait, wait. Don't tell me. Let me live in the illusion. You've been injured. Sure you went right back in the thick of it? Are you kidding? I want to kick the Reapers straight to hell. Cerberus, too. People in their death say their lives flash before their eyes. Well, the future flashed for me. The anguish, the, the families, the children. It made me determined to live. I need to do something, Shepard. To save at least a few lives. Give me the update, Major. What update? <laughs> Major, yeah. Congrats. There's obviously been a lot going on. Anderson asked me to take over a spec ops program. First Special Operations Biotics Division. Mm -hmm. We're been, recruiting the most you? talented human biotics from around the galaxy. What's the focus? Covert high-risk missions. Turn it down at first. I mean, teaching? <laughs> I prefer to get my hands dirty. Anderson can be pretty persuasive. Yeah. Hey, hard -ass, but Shepard. <laughs> argue with this kind of experience. What are you doing? Squatting? Wouldn't take no. Said it had to be me. With your history, you're the perfect choice. True. Human biotics are... Well, we're different. Freaks, even. Most people in the galaxy still see us that way. But accepting it, embracing it, can be the difference between success and sitting at home in your PJs, taking red sand. You said your implant got rattled. Ah, Anything good? Found, your uh, the found a great... The head is. But my bio... Or maybe you have. Horizon... Are we going to be able to get past what happened on Horizon? I'd like to, Shepard. I'd like to move past the harsh words and be friends. At least. So, how do we fix it? Mm. I'll admit, I own a lot of that. You were standing right in front of me and I was... I shut you down. I'm sorry. Okay. Okay, so let's just put it behind us and get on with what's important right now. Bury it? Bury it. Forgive it. I... I think that's how we get past Horizon. I should probably get going. Thanks for coming by. 
Take care, Caden. Okay, why'd you get in? Ila bira ba? all night. You know why? Same reason they got all quiet and serious when you walked in. You don't seem intimidated by me in the least. In fact, you could use a little more deference. <laughs> <laughs> sure, but I fought with you. I've seen you in action. Now, don't get me wrong, you're good. Probably one of the best. Probably? And you fill out a uniform like nobody's business. Just saying. But I know you're human, just like me. But not them. Nope. Hell, I still remember the day they made you the first human inspector. I watched it on the vids, just like all of them. But to them, you're still larger than life. I've seen a hell of a lot, but I'm still just a soldier. I'm still one of them. Sure, but they don't know you. They just know what they've been told. Listen, you want them to see you're one of us, right? Maybe. Then buy them around. Hey! I don't have money. Let's not overdo it. Well, you could at least buy me around. I had a feeling you were working up to that. Yeah, and I have a feeling you're not gonna buy me one. You sure you don't wanna buy me a drink? I'm just gonna hang here for a while. Should I have brought in ground? Okay. That was the evil ground. Yeah, the, the troops need. Commander Shepard, maybe I can help. 
The banner of the 1st Regiment is waiting for you at Bay D-24. The banner of Commander Shepard. I owe you a drink. Thank you. We'll hold that banner proudly as we take our homeworld back from these bastards. <laughs> the banner of the 1st Regiment. That should put some steel in their spine. Area. VIP lounge. So you admit you and your thugs are here illegally? Yes, and it only took CSEC three weeks to figure it out. I don't care who you are. You're required to go through processing like all other refugees. Come with me. I don't think so. Shirk, get me the Asari counselor. Arya, to what do I owe the pleasure? I'm being asked submit to immigration processing. I see. And now you've been processed. Is there anything else? Nothing. Thank you. Anytime. I think we're done here. Enjoy Bottle the show, too. Shepard? I guess there's one rule on the Citadel, huh? I guess so. I hate this place. So sickeningly uptight. Then why are you here? Cerberus stole Omega from me. The elusive man is now squarely at the top of my ship list. What happened? He will pay for every second I've spent in this bureaucratic hellhole. How did Cerberus defeat you? Deceit, distraction, and a big fucking army. They lured me away from Omega and ambushed me. I escaped, but Cerberus had already laid siege. By the time I could launch an assault, they were too entrenched. At least you escaped to fight another day. And that day is coming. I'll take Omega back, but I'll get to that. You're here because I have a proposition. I'm listening. The way I see it, if you don't defeat the Reapers, we're all dead. Won't matter where I'm sitting. It's in my interest to help you. What are you offering, Arya? On Omega, I kept the blood pack, blue suns, and eclipse in check. Now they're running amok. Nobody wants that. Unite them under my rule, and you'll have a powerful and ruthless mm. force for your war. I've laid the groundwork with all three groups. I just need you to close the deals. Give a criminal a gun, he'll shoot you in the back. They already have guns, Shepard. I'll make sure they point them at the Reapers. I'm trying to help you. Why don't you think it over? Meet with Narl, my agent who's dealing with the Blood Pack. The Blue Sun's leader is incognito here on the Citadel. He'll be expecting you. And I already have a deal with Jonas Sedaris, the Eclipse leader. You just have to get your friend, Commander Bailey, to let her out. <laughs> you obviously don't know Bailey very well. Bailey respects you. Lean on him. I think a united force of professional mercs is worth it. Don't you? It's always a pleasure, Shepard. Let me know if you want to talk later. Talk now. Look who's here. So what's on your mind, Shepard? What's new with you? That's supposed to be funny? Let's see. I've lost Omega. I got CSEC eyes all over me, and I'm holed up in this poor excuse for a nightclub. Can't even get an ovarian rum here. In other words, I'm in hell. How do you plan on taking Omega back? I think I'm going to employ violence. <laughs> I'm gonna slap Omega right out of the elusive man's greedy little hands. What's your angle on gaining control of the blood pack? Narl will explain it. If we're gonna work together, Shepard, you need to trust me. At least a little. How do we get the Blue Suns on our side? Their leader, Darner Vosk, is a twisted little criminal. I expected his demands to be unreasonable, but it turns out he's the biggest pushover of them all. Talk to him. I'll let you be the judge. Call me if you need to. How am I supposed to talk Bailey into letting Jonas Sedaris out of prison? 
I've already leaned on the council. Bailey is in direct defiance of their order. So talk to him. One boy scout to another, chain of command and all that crap. Take him to dinner, talk dirty to him, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> we'll talk later. I'm sure. Embassies. Now arriving at Presidium Embassy. Yes, I have spoken to you before. Why do you refuse to help me? If it's possible that my son Bilal is alive, I will not. Hey, Bilal again? He's found the Alliance military what? has abandoned the Hades Gamma cluster to incoming. I fully understand the situation. Of course, I read through the names of the dead every day, but. Please, please, a few more minutes of searching could mean a lifetime of peace for my family. Someone in your family is MIA? My son Balaam. Bila Birama. Bureaucratic compassion seems to be in short supply. I am Ambassador Dominic Osoba. My son's squad returned from their mission on Benning without him. I found them drinking, but they won't even look me in the eye. I can offer a bounty for any information. If Balao's alive, we want him home. If he's dead, then... then we can begin to mourn him. If I find anything, I'll let you know. Thank you. Either way, you will set my mind at ease. <laughs> the continues as the Reapers occupy most of Panama. It appears that Turian. Yeah. Because I heard Bilal. The John Grissom Academy, founded in 2176, mm -hmm. is the Alliance's premier school for young human biotics. The institution is housed in a space station in orbit over the human colony of Alex Gart. For new power. I can do that?
Oh, I don't need to go there. Lady Chang, yo. Shepard, to what do I owe the pleasure? Here to talk to you about releasing Jonas Adaris. Damn, you too? Somebody got the council to order her release. I'm delaying as best I can. What's your stake in this? It's classified. Ha <laughs> way of saying mind your own business. Look, there's no way I'm letting that psychopath out. The woman's unstable and a clear public threat. How unstable? What makes you think she's crazy? She was a ruthless sadist before she got caught. Her imprisonment has cracked a shell off the nut. Maybe freedom will improve her. She rages day and night, Shepard, calling for the deaths of all Eclipse enemies. No, freedom will only give her the chance to kill. I'd like access to her to judge for myself. Sure thing. I'm sure you'll agree. Then maybe the Council will listen to you and rescind the order. Go to the CSEC outpost. My assistant will connect to Sedera's cell from there. Then call me back. Call me back. John Dumbau, Special Tactics and Recon. I've got intel suggesting that high-level Hanar officials may be indoctrinated. That's a damning accusation. What have you got? Evidence of an Alliance Black Ops team raiding a Batarian research station. The Batarians were studying Reaper technology. The Batarians had Reaper technology? The Alliance raid turned into a massacre, and the humans ended up with nothing. Your people faked a power failure to hide the incident. The Batarians would have gone to war if they'd found out. But how does this implicate the Hanar? They maintained discreet grey market trade relationships with the Batarians, and led the Alliance to the station. We suspect those Hanar operatives escaped with Batarian tech. If your reports on the Reapers are accurate, they could already be indoctrinated. What's your source on all this? It was an anonymous gift, but I believe it came from a thief named Kasumi Goto. Hmm. I've been after her for years. Kasumi? You're hunting a thief? <laughs> a master thief. Her intelligence and skill are almost Solarian. I'm sure she'd appreciate praise from the Spectre who's chasing her down. I only need her data. I admire her personally. And since she sent me this, I assume her feelings are mutual. What do you need me to do? The Hanar operative is now a diplomat on the Citadel. <laughs> I don't have a public name, and the Hanar will go to ground if I make a formal inquiry. So we're hunting? I'm tracking suspicious transmissions to the Hanar homeworld. I could use your help. Let me see what I can dig up at the Spectre office. Thanks, Shepard. And for the record, not everyone doubted your concerns about the Reapers. I just hope we're not too late. <laughs> you are too late. Ah, Kasumi! So, remember when you helped me get KG's Grey Box from Donovan Hawk? The one with information that could start a war? Information like an Alliance Black Ops raid on a Batarian research lab? I figured it wouldn't hurt to leak it now. Especially if there really is an indoctrinated jellyfish out there. Crazier than usual. Hey, if Kasumi. you don't mind me tagging along cloaked, maybe I can help you dig up some dirt on the Hanar. I appreciate it. I need you. I need you, Kasumi. You my team. I'm broke, Kasumi. Uh. <sighs> Thank you. 
Owl's got a good plan. Hannah are predictable. Anything suspicious in their terminal use should narrow down our list of suspects. So you approve of Bao? Absolutely. He's a good specter. The galaxy needs more like him. And Sorry. Well, nobody's perfect. Can I run? I can. But I need to run. It's long enough. Kasumi Goto. Shepard? Did you know a lot of people on Earth? Hey, I forgot that. Many. It's monk. I, I required a second VI just to try. Any news from Earth? There is constant news. All of it. Mm. We have a handful of quantum and time. Same thing. I should go. I'll be here. Uh, bye. The outpost is. Kalua again. Embassy office. Okay, anyway. What? The Alliance military has abandoned the Hades Gamma cluster to incoming Reaper. Dang. Hey, Garus. Some possible hits. Got some strange money transfers on Balon, and Olun is sending a lot of data. Balon's clean. His money transfers are to support his mistress. Not sure about Olun. I'll pull his bio. I'll check Olun's purse. Can I just note how odd it is for a Hanar to have a mistress? You know, if Val catches up with you, I can grant you immunity. What? If I join up? Last time I did that, you were. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't say you had to join up. <laughs> this giant. Yes, I have spoken to you before. Where should I go next? Then I should go to the seaside, right? Welcome, Commander Shepard. Please select the destination. One moment, please. Now arriving at Presidium mm, Commons. Vanessa Davis, no. Okay. Uh, tomorrow then. Episode 2. Kasumi Goto.